it's Liam with Lovely Scrappin. I'm here to show you a completed project for Flip a Can or Two on Artfire. So I'll have all the links posted below, so be sure to check her out. I'm gonna be really quick here because I am downstairs and I'm sorry I have the TV going, but I'm just about to leave for work and my daughter is the only way to kind of keep her occupied kind of while I'm talking because she can't stand it when I'm talking um, when it's not to her. <laughs> so anyway, I'm going to be really quick. Um, so again, I did a start to finish tutorial, so be sure to watch that to see how I put this together. The paper collection I think is called The Green Stack by DCWV. The inspiration for the card is from Leonie. She's my passion for paper and she gave me a card and a rack a while ago and th I, that's the first time I'd ever see the folded kind of a pocket kind of card so I really loved it and I wanted to give it a whirl so thanks Leonie for the inspiration so here's my card it's my very first kind of cutesy card um, our friends just had their baby boy the other day and we're gonna go visit them today um, and give this to them so that's why I have to record this now um, so anyways it's a six by six card and it is a folded pocket style and you'll watch how I put that together and I used a little planter label um, that I got from the dollar store a while ago and um, I just kind of stuck it in there and lined it with paper, layered it with paper and put um, it on some foam pieces as well as the paper on foam pieces to kind of give it to mention. I put a little butterfly here, here and here from the Martha Stewart punch and just added little pearls to it. Sorry, my daughter is very, very chatty. Um, these are some flowers from Cassie's Art Fire and they're like this porcelain beautiful Cali lilies. Here's some flat back pearls from Cassie's Art Fire as well. Um, I just put some yellow ribbon. This is what the back of the card looks like. The yellow ribbon goes all the way on the back and again I used the Martha Stewart punch there and Spellbinders dies here to um, do my little created by or handmade by label. Um, and then this is also the Martha Stewart Border Punch. Um, these are just some little I Am Roses flowers here. This is just one of those charm, um, I think it's a Blue Moon charm. I got it from Walmart in their craft section and it's um, like a little safety pin and it's got little spots to hang charms. So I put this little charm piece together with the beads. There as you can see and the jump rings and the little charms there. Um, and this is up on dimensionals here and a little beaver eye fussy cut and paste it onto this designer paper and then um, stamps new arrival there and stamped it's a boy and baby and all of those are from the Martha Stewart um, stamp set and I think I show that in the um, video. Um, these here are the bead caps from Cassie's Art Fire and I just adhered them with um, little button brads. What you got there? Okay. Yeah. You can take that. That's okay. And I made a little banner here and kind of made it dimensional. And then um, here, oh, and I put a little satin bow there as you can see. And then here it just pulls out. Okay, that's okay, baby girl. Oh, thank you. That's great. Thank you, sweet. Do you want to play with that? Okay. Um, and then this is using the Tim Holtz on the edge die. It's that Baroque one and then the other one is this one, which kind of looks like that ticket. Or, um, sorry, a stamp edge. And then this is the part of the paper collection and I just put it there and I'll write my little note or our little note there. And that's just the back, that's where the brads came through. And um, all of the, all the distressing here is using pumice stone distressing from Tim Holtz. <coughs> <clears throat> it just, I like the way it just kind of edged, like as you can see, instead of just white, it kind of just edged it nicely and it went well with the kind of a charcoal color paper here. So anyways guys, I know I went through that really quick, um, but I have to get going here. Um, I hope you like, if you have any questions, um, hopefully they'll get answered in the video following. And um, yeah, thanks so much for watching. Take care everybody. Please leave a comment. Bye. Kira, say bye-bye. Bye.
Sorry.